For the last eight years, Americans have lived under an administration that endorsed warrantless wiretapping, that endorsed torture, that endorsed rendition of prisoners to countries known to use torture. And all of those policies now are well documented, in part because of uh, work that the ACLU and, and other organizations have done under the Freedom of Information Act. But there's still some documents that are secret, and those documents include the memos written by government lawyers, the Office of Legal Counsel lawyers, um, to supply a legal basis for these national security programs. We think the public has a right to know um, why it was that the Bush administration thought it was lawful to engage in torture. It's impossible to fully understand what the Bush administration did and why it did it without seeing these memos that purported to uh, supply a legal basis for the for the warrantless wiretapping program and the torture and rendition programs. And what we are doing today is asking the new Office of Legal Counsel, the, the new um, the new leadership of that office to reconsider the decision to withhold all of these legal memos from the public. The public has a right to see these memos. It's impossible to move forward without actually uh, having some degree of transparency about what took place over the last eight years. Uh, and we're hopeful that our, the requests we're making today uh, will lead to some degree of transparency.